Hey guys, what's up? We're back with another unboxing and this time of this month's Super Geek Box. Uh, last month was actually a two-parter box, two boxes, uh, an exclusive edition and you guys really like that one. Uh, it, I think it was my first uh, mystery box in general and you seem to really be fond of this one. So I'm really excited for October's Super Geek Box. Shall we open it up? Yes, we shall. And, oh, there's, of course, what? <laughs> What is that? What? What is this? I'm... I'm confused. Oh, it is... Ah, uh, it is a foam chainsaw hand. Ugh, it smells horrible. Uh, <laughs> oh, really? This is, this is... This is what we're doing? This is, um... I mean, I, I get those. I, I get that. They have some sports ball and whatnot, but come on. Really? You expect me to walk around with this? This is... I'm a, I'm a serial killer with Eric Tell dysfunction or something. What, what is that supposed to be? Yeah, squeezing that in definitely didn't help it out. It's like right here. It's, it's fantastic. Oof. <laughs> and it smells really, really bad. Mmm. It smells like cancer. Oh, mm, I'm, I'm, <laughs> let's just hope that this was a filler item. That, <laughs> well, right off to the next one. Let's just forget that this happened. Oh, I have, I have red little crumbs all over the place. Can you see them? Can you see them on the camera? I guess it's, it's, it's better than pure packing material. You know what? On one hand, you could say, well, it's packing material. It's better than normal one. No, it's not. It's, just it smells really bad and it leaves little red crumbs everywhere ah well let's move on to the villainous cloak of chaos okay it's the it's the super geek box wearable series <coughs> this is my nose that stuff this is my nose or something mm. all right we're good we're back on track all right this is the Villainous Cloak of Chaos. Let's see what this is about. I might need some instruction on this. Oh! Oh, I get it. I, I get it. I, I think it's like this. <laughs> Everything makes me sneeze. What's going on? So, I can go and rob a bank now. At least I assume that's the idea of this. I don't know about this. I might have to see the instructions. Maybe I'm doing it wrong. Maybe it's the pillowcase thing all over again and I'm using it completely wrong. Who knows? We'll see later. All right, what we got next? Yeah, we got a little plush. Mopies. Ah, uh, oh, they're sad. That's why. This looks like a panda bear, not like Jack Skellington. But it is, uh, yeah, proper made in Vietnam Funko Disney approved toys. And it doesn't smell bad. That's really nice after <laughs> some other things that nearly made me choke. He's cute. He's a, he's a cute little, little plush. I like him. He's cute. I don't see anything bad on him. Nothing plastic that could potentially make my dogs choke. Nope. That's great. Come on. Will she accept us as one of her own? Will she take the bait? Yep. And we're coming to the next one. What do we have here? A shirt. Oh, what is that? I can already see the Joker, can't I? <laughs> we have a crying Joker. At least I assume that's what this is. It looks like it. Oh, he looks so sad. Well, better put it on. What a snazzy shirt. <laughs> I have to turn this down a little bit so you can see it a little bit better. I think, I think, I think you heard his funny bone. I think you heard his funny bone. Well, at least it doesn't have the Super Geekbox logo directly on the shirt, like many others do. It's not a bad shirt, it's actually well printed. Not the biggest fan of the motif, but I think that's more a question of taste than anything else. What do you have here? Ooh, ooh, I can actually, actually use this. This is actually something I need because Mar vomited into my car. And it has the slight aftertaste, the slight smell of kibble, of wet kibble. Hmm. What, what smell is this? I, I have no idea. Something chemical. It's fruity. I don't know. You, you want to take a whiff? This could prove 
useful. Ah, I shouldn't have opened it. Now it's gonna, now it's gonna dry out or something. But I wanted to know what it smells like. Well, it's an air freshener. If if you got a car that needs freshening or any other place that is in need of urgent freshening, here you get a scared ghost. Next in the list, the pin. Wait, actually, there's I think there's something else before we go. More pop rocks. Ha! Huh. Interesting. I wonder if they were inspired or if that is just a thing that they do during uh, the Halloween season. Is that a particular Halloweeny thing? Because I think was it the Super Geek Fuel or the One Up Box? I forgot. One of those two had pop rocks in them, and then we have pop rocks again. I'm okay with that. And last but not least, we have a little flyer telling us what this month's box is all about. I could have gotten two other ones from the little Mopies collection. Fractured Funny Bone. For once, the bad and his trusty sidekick get the last laugh. Every clown eventually has his day. And yep, yeah, that's that's supposed to be the mask. Granted, it looks really cool when you have actually glowing ice and fire coming out of it. And this thing doesn't look like, you know, Eric tell this function. I'm gonna keep those for later. Ah, uh, fantastic. Anyway, guys. If you want to get one of these boxes yourself monthly delivered to your doorstep, you can do with the link in the description below. This month... Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm not I'm not impressed. I gotta be completely honest with you. This is a really weird box. I always appreciate the t-shirt, but that someone did not think this through. Oh, that's why he's holding it down. Then then it works. If if you hold it down, it looks a little bit like it. Ah. Anyway, guys, if you want to get one of these boxes yourself, you can do that with the link in the description below. And by doing so, you support my channel directly. And I hope you enjoyed this unboxing. If you did, please leave a like. I'm Weasel. I'm out. And I hope to see you around. Bye-bye. <laughs> It's just, it's just awkward. Bird. 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 Bird.